Hey everybody, uh, my name is Tony Cullen, coming to you here uh, today. Um, really just wanted to follow uh, what I feel is the Holy Spirit's direction uh, in my life. Uh, first came to Christ in my own free will about uh, two years ago. And just was in a place, wasn't really happy, miserable, mad, and just thankfully got plugged into it. Uh, and I eventually made the choice to invite Christ into my life and the results have been amazing and I just want to be able to share that um, with everybody and through talking with some of the friends you know that I have now just kind of lamenting the fact that you know just this desire and really want this spiritual awakening um, things, you know just to get out there where is the church with a lot of stuff that's going on now where is you know, people of religion, Christians, to speak up and say, hey, this, you know, this is wrong, this isn't right. Um, and I've kind of had it on, say, on my heart, something the Spirit's put there for me is to go out, uh, talk to people, do some traveling, uh, obviously not so much now with COVID, but just talk to them, you know, about God. And really, it's all about Him and for His glory and be able to share a little bit of my story, what I've been through, um, you know, put it out there and just bring people to him. I remember being out in the woods, you know, and just praying to him and the things that came through real clearly, um, you know, number one, help bring people to him and, you know, also number two, uh, to tell a little bit of my story. Um, so that's, that's what I'm doing here today. That's what we'll do. Um, and really just really feeling it inside about, um, you know, the Holy Spirit. Maybe talking about things that, you know, you don't hear a lot about or don't want to talk about. Um, and really approaching it from, say, Bible-based uh, perspective. Uh, talk about those gifts of the Holy Spirit. When I'm talking about the gifts of the Holy Spirit, what I'm really, you know, what I mean or a place that you can go uh, for more is, of course, uh, 1 Corinthians uh, 12 through 14. Uh, so I've really been spending some time in that, praying through those, praying for those uh, gifts of the Spirit. Um, you know, for those who may not be really familiar, the gifts of the Spirit, wisdom, knowledge, uh, faith, healing, miraculous powers, uh, prophecy, uh, distinguishing spirits, you know, because evil spirits will try and give false prophecy as well, so we need to have those. Speaking in tongues, also interpreting tongues. A lot of times, you know, we hear that and think, oh, that's crazy. Or that was only during, you know, when Jesus was alive or something. And No, it's happening now. And this is to help give, you know, people encouragement. It, encouragement. It's never gone away. It's still here. There is this, you know, revival that's, that's happening. Um, and so in the future sessions, I think I'm going to talk about, you know, some of these uh, gifts of spirit flesh those out a little bit more um, you know and if you read through that though the thing that's really cool really interesting is yeah you can have all these gifts of the spirit but you know love is really the means by which um, they're effective uh, if it's done in love the other big thing is that they have to be for um, you know the benefit of all 